Hey home cooks, welcome back to Greg's Recipes. Today I'm making meatballs. So there are tons of different versions of meatballs. Everybody loves them and I'm gonna show you the one that I like to make. The first thing we're gonna do is combine some breadcrumbs and milk in a bowl and let it soak for a little while. Next we're gonna chop up some onion. Next we're gonna saute some onions and garlic in olive oil until it's translucent. Once the onions and garlic are ready, I can add them to the bowl along with the rest of my ingredients. To the bowl we're going to add one pound of ground beef, one pound of ground pork, two eggs, some grated Parmesan cheese, salt and pepper, and we're also going to chop up some parsley and add that too. Now we just need to combine all the ingredients. So now we just need to form our meatballs by rolling them in our hands. To cook the meatballs, I'm going to heat some olive oil in a Dutch oven. Once the oil is hot, we're going to place each meatball into the Dutch oven and let it get a nice crust on one side. Now we can flip the meatballs over and let them cook on the other side. Now we're going to add in some marinara sauce. I'm using just a jarred marinara sauce because I was too lazy to make it myself. Maybe I'll save that for another video. Now I'm going to let the meatballs simmer in the marinara sauce for two and a half to three hours. And there you have it, meatballs. So you may have noticed that some of my meatballs kind of broke up and turned my marinara sauce into kind of more like a meat sauce, which I personally don't mind, but if you don't want that to happen, uh, I can suggest that you might want to use more breadcrumbs than I did so it binds the meatballs better, or use a non-stick pan so they don't stick to the bottom of the pan, make it harder to flip them in one piece, which I was having a little trouble with. Um, but if you want them to turn out like mine, do it exactly like I did. And as always, let's take a bite. It's really light, really meaty. The sauce really added a lot of flavor. That's really good. I hope you make it for yourself and enjoy it. If you enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe for a new Gregsby every Tuesday. I don't know why I said it like that. And put some... Let the meatballs simmer in the 